Chris Moore Mafia here, and I can already tell you're here interested in an ECU flash, where we're going to go over a few things in this video to help you understand exactly what you're getting and to answer some commonly asked questions that you may have. So the first thing that a lot of people ask is, what is the difference between a Dino Tune and an ECU flash? Well, with some companies, they do just unrestricting the bike and changing the fan temps and stuff. Here at More Mafia, you are actually getting a Dino Tune from someone else's motorcycle with similar modifications. So each tune that we send out is one that we have built and generated here on our Dino here at home. The modifications may not be exactly the same as yours, but they're going to be really close and they're going to get you a really close result, okay? Could you get an improvement by putting it on the dyno? Of course, definitely you sure could. But for the average guy that's just riding around having fun on the street, racing his buddies here and there, or just wants a better riding smoother motorcycle that's making the power that it should make from the factory, this is all you need. So we're going to go over a few common questions that we get asked all the time, and all the answers are right here on the website. So the first question is, can my bike be flash? Well, if you'll scroll down below after you watch this video, we've got a list of all the bikes that we can do. Now, if you have a 2021 or something new that just came out, you can always email to see if it's something we can do, but if you have something older that's not on the list, chances are we cannot do it, period. Just some ECUs are not supported or not able to be flashed if it's an earlier year model bike. All right, so another common question is, what if I add modifications later? Do I need to resend in my ECU to have it reflash? Well, the answer to that is maybe, yes, possibly. So if you have a slip-on exhaust and then you later change to a full system exhaust, then yes, you do need to send your ECU back in and we charge $100 for the reflash plus the return shipping. So it's not quite as expensive, but it's definitely not free either. The next thing is if you just change maybe from a stock air filter to an aftermarket air filter, something like that, a small change is not going to necessarily have to be a complete retune or reflash. You would not need to send in your ECU. So if that becomes a question later on, after you get the flash, you can always email us and we can tell you directly, you know, for sure whether you need to send it in or not. Another common question we get is, what if I have a Power Commander or a Bazaz now? Will the flash work for me or do I need to adjust anything? Well, the question is, yes, the flash will definitely work for you, but we definitely want you to zero out your Power Commander or Bazaz or just remove it completely. If you are just riding your bike on the street and just having fun, pretty much a good idea just to get rid of the Power Commander or Bazaz altogether. You can sell it. That'll recoup some of the cost for the flash. And if you're racing competitively and you live a long ways away from us and can't get your bike to us to put on the dyno, then you can zero it out, take the bike to a dyno, and then have it tweaked from there in your area to make your bike perfect for the racetrack. How soon do we send the ECUs back out is also another common question we get. We usually send the ECUs back out the same day we receive them or the next day. The only time they go out the next day is if one, we have a ton of stuff going on here at the shop or B, it arrives on a Saturday and we don't ship it out until Monday or whatever. But usually we get the ECUs out super fast all the time. All right, next question is how do you get your ECU flash? Well, it's easy. I've got a list of a few bikes down below that show how to remove the ECU. But if you don't see the video, here on our website, it's not very hard to remove 90% of the bikes. So usually they're located under the front seat or under the gas tank on mo most motorcycles. Simply just remove the seat, pop the ECU out, put it in a box. But before you box it up and send it off, we need you to do one simple thing for us. Take a piece of paper, write down your name, address, and phone number for where we're going to send it back to and then write down a list of all the modifications your bike has done to it. So in other words, what exhaust does it have? What air filter does it have? What sprockets do you have? Let us know all those modifications on that piece of paper and then simply take that piece of paper to the ECU itself, box it up. You can take it to the UPS store. 
to FedEx, to the mailman, wherever you want to take it, you ship it to us. Then you go on our link down below and click check out. So you'll actually buy the ECU flash on the website here. There's a list of options that you have to go through as well. So it's going to ask you, do you want to run pump gas, which is just gas from the gas station, or do you want to run race gas, like an MR12 or a different type of fuel? The different types of fuel is considered a stage two tune. That tune does add to the price, but when you click the option, it shows you that in the, in the website. Another thing uh, it's going to ask you is about the quick shifter fix. Now that option is for people who have a quick shifter on their motorcycle from the factory. If your bike did not come with a quick shifter from the manufacturer, then this option does not apply to you. So you don't have to click that. If your bike does have a quick shifter on it from the factory, clicking that option is going to add $50 to the price, but it makes your shifter much faster, much less lag, much less delay. It really improves the overall experience of the quick shifter itself. All right, so the next thing it's gonna ask you is, what kind of return shipping do you want back from us? So we have two different options. We use USPS, United States Postal Service, AKA the post office. Uh, we use priority mail as our standard shipping. That's typically two to three days time. We also have an option for overnight air shipping, which most of the time is actually overnight air. There are certain places, rural areas, whatever, that sometimes you get it in two days, okay? So it's not absolutely guaranteed. It's guaranteed that I'm gonna pay for overnight service and I'm gonna provide you with a tracking number for overnight service. If it takes two days to get there, that's between you and the post office but I'm doing my part to get it there as quick as possible. If you live out of the country and would like to get your ECU flash, we do have an international option available. However, our website will not automatically calculate international shipping. So if you do have an ECU and you live out of the United States, please feel free to email us, let us know what kind of bike you have and give us your full return address and we will get you a quote on the shipping price headed back to your direction. All right, so now you've paid for the ECU, you send your ECU in, you got your ECU back, what's next? You, when you get your ECU, it's gonna come with a piece of paper with instructions on it. You're gonna plug the ECU in, turn the key on, turn the key off, blah, blah, blah. There's a little process you're gonna go through that's all written down in there. You're gonna fire your bike up and take it for a ride. If you were to have a check engine light or something isn't right, you could always feel free to email or call the shop 864-244-5447 and we'll be glad to answer any questions you may have to get you taken care of. After you've taken your bike for a ride and you like the results, we definitely encourage you to make a social media post, whether it be Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, whatever you got. Let everybody know that More Mafia did a good job on your ECU and you highly recommend our service. If you guys have any more questions about this video or whatever you have the question on, feel free to email us or give us a call here at the shop. Thanks for watching guys and enjoy that ECU flash.